<laughs> you think that's a gimmick, dude? <laughs> yeah. I, you know, I'm like, why do I keep, keep, keep getting served these ads? I'm not interested. So I, yeah, it comes with the leather good? straps like this, too. <laughs> <laughs> I'll stick with the ball gag thing, though, guys. It turned into <laughs> open your mouth too wide. Apparently, it's just kind of one of those things I wish I didn't know, but like, if you open up, it's like, <laughs> what, what were you trying to get in there? <laughs> well, I wasn't going to name names. <laughs> oh, <it's all. laughs> Here's our first lawsuit. But he needs an upper body support. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen. Gossip Boys here with another Topic Thunder. My name is Silent Mike. We got Dean Sidoris, CaffeineKilos.com, the one and only Jim McD, 3SB.co, and Killer Kai. <coughs> We've all been in the industry quite a while. Way longer than I'd like to be. Hey. It's a long journey here. It goes by fast, too. Uh, it does. It's over a decade yeah. for me. Yeah, no, uh, that's way over that for me. What is the craziest, weirdest, gimmicky thing? The fitness is known for gimmicks. We're known for detox oh. teas. This base layer of pop culture loves fitness, especially all of a sudden, right? All these uh, celebrities are trying to do yoga and the new this, and they're all gluten-free and they're all vegan. We're all in California, so we get some of it. But we'd like to think we dug down a little bit into what works with science. What's the weirdest, craziest thing, whether it, it could be in our pocket or on this surface layer that you've ever seen? And if you don't got one, I can start out the way. Hmm. I Probably mean, it's, I don't have one. It's gonna yeah, be hard to beat the fucking shake weight. Yeah, I was gonna say shake, shake weight's pretty weight. good. I love the shake, but weight. I don't want to talk too much about the shake weight because everybody knows about it. So let's think of some other ones. Uh, I, <laughs> you think that's a gimmick, dude? <laughs> yeah. I've put a. Uh, I think it's an SS, SNL or maybe a Mad TV. I think it's a Mad TV skit that's basically f making fun of this shake weight, which m makes you know that when pop culture is making fun of it, mm. like it's such a gimmick. It's like amazing. you're right, like shake weight's too big. Yeah, yeah. But they sit on this thing, and oh yeah, you've seen my yeah. video, right? Oh yeah, and it's basically yeah. like a shake weight that goes between your legs and, and it's long and you yeah sit it's there. long and, and uh, ribbed the, the, yeah the <laughs> tug toner yeah, yeah. The, tug yeah. Toner. Tug the tug toner skit tug tug the toner. craziest one and i've actually got uh, uh quite a bit of views on this which is lovely but i think whoa, whoa they started whoa. to get uh uh they started to try to sponsor me and i don't know if they found this video is the uh jaw trainer oh uh, yeah i think i used to see those ads on my feet and i'm like why do i keep, keep, keep getting served these ads i'm not interested so i think i ripped them in a video and it's like we're you know biggest gimmick in all of fitness or something and i ripped them and then not only would their ad play on there just because random fitness stuff but they started to email me trying to sponsor me sending me a rubber piece of gum to chew on like why wouldn't i just chew gum the owner's a fucking kook too. yeah i'm like, sure and it maybe it works right like there is a muscle in our jaw but same idea like do i need to build it would it make me more attractive i don't know and uh, yeah. then like why don't i just chew gum they that guy's fighting for his life in his comments i've seen it oh i'm sure oh, he's that guy he'll, down he'll, he'll post he, he, yeah. he'll post like of him like doing it or whatever and then all the comments are like because he said like in the video it talks about like define your jaw in it. and it shows like a picture of a guy like like oh, looking kind of like this and the next picture he's fucking just chiseled <laughs> and, some, and then so people in the comments are like yo does this grow your jaw like what does this do <laughs> and in his comment it's like a copy paste all he says he's like what this does is it builds these muscles around yeah. the neck and it's like he won't There's actually no directly say anything i'm like bro you're fucked like just stop but it. that engagement's popping Oh, yeah. dude, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hate. That's like, like I said, definition of like good publicity or any publicity yeah. is good publicity. I want to see the books on. Yeah, because someone bought it to someone bought joke that. as a joke. Yeah, or, yeah. or like they probably made some money. What if got the? It yeah. comes with the little fucking necklace too, so you can just like wear it around. And so, you so it's can like, use like a baba, yeah. so like a, a kid's baba. It's a gag. Exactly it okay, oh, baba, if it yeah, tasted yeah. like something, oh, that might be a thing. Yeah, a little grape chew it's on. A gag. I'd yeah. probably do it. Yeah, it comes with the leather good? straps like this too. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe get a girlfriend and a strong yeah. jaw. Yeah, you're gonna Kinky really, you're gonna get all the girls walking around with that around your neck. That, that's, what I, that's what I'm saying. If they're into it, what about more? This is a little bit more like not as crazy, but yeah. a lot of like big the mouthpiece. Oh, just in general, training yeah. with a mouthpiece. Yeah, I mean, I think training with a mouthpiece isn't a terrible idea, but they tell you that you freaking like align your jaw down to your neck down to your spine for ultra power Dan, danny's got a good take on the mouthpiece oh no danny's, <laughs> danny's take on the mouthpiece i is think danny's more of an optimist than i am in many <laughs> oh, of these things no remember oh remember we were doing the nose breathing mouth breathing you're like he, he danny's kind of into it he, i'm like that was a, that was an exception all right all right i danny's, just feel like danny's he's an optimist got a, danny's got a good uh a take on the mouthpiece he's like if you're not t squatting 3x or 2x body weight 
you you, you shouldn't even be thinking about a mouth guard. Yeah, yeah, mm. that is the last piece. It's the same idea. Like, what shoes you're wearing? Like, dude, learn how to squat. Yeah, don't even like. Yeah, I you shouldn't even be thinking about a mouth guard unless you're squatting like three x or body weight. Unless I, you have expensive veneers, in which case, even yeah. still, okay. I okay, okay. I want that's, like, uh-huh. that's like we're talking about the point zero three percent there. Yeah. Yeah, 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 and 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 it is cheap, and it's if it makes you want work out more, go buy yourself a mouthpiece. But it ain't a line in your jaw to yeah, yeah. unleash power. No, what all it does is keep you from grinding your teeth together. Yeah, that's or or if you're biting, yeah, it feels good sometimes. Yeah. So. Okay. I need veneers and swat three times my body weight, and then I <laughs> and then I get a twenty dollar Under Armour piece. <laughs> yes. Yay! Yes. Yes. I'll stick with the ball gag. Thanks, turned, though, guys. It turned into <laughs> honestly, or just buy that and just get two two for one. True. Yeah. I'll, yeah. I'll try to fit two in the back. You call it a super set, dude. Yeah. You're squatting, Bro. training your legs and your jaw. How dude. many people have been injured or gotten jaw related injuries? Yeah, was it from TMJ that and shit? Probably everyone. Dude. Cracked like, tooth. Oh, like that thing's got to absolutely destroy your, your your teeth are probably moving too much in your gums. Mm-hmm. You ever uh, like back and up. forth? Some lady uh, dislocated her jaw eating a fucking KFC sandwich oh. and had to have uh, like a four hour surgery on her jaw just because she opened her mouth too wide. Apparently, this is kind of one of those things I wish I didn't know. But like, if you <laughs> open up, it's like if you open up your mouth to a certain point, if your jaw just un- comes apart, oh sure, it's yeah, like yeah. a yeah, six hour it's, surgery. It's, the hinge in the back's like this. Oh, dude, it's like a yep. nightmare surgery to get your jaw put back together. So <sighs> humans are not boa constrictors, is what you're saying? Sounds yes. horrible, dude. And it makes me like I feel like, like, like I've gotten close to that point, dude. <laughs> I'll bet you. I'll bet what, you have. What were you trying to get in there? <laughs> a burger. What kind of? Yeah. What kind of? Eight a burger. By eight a burger. KFC burger. <laughs> the one with the chicken patties yeah. instead of bun. Yeah, I've there, been there. There's so many gimmicks. Uh, we won't name names, but basically, you put like a lubricant and then you sweat more. Huh? Yeah. What? You know. Yeah. Sweet sweat. Well, I wasn't gonna name names. <laughs> oh, <it's all. laughs> the year's our first lawsuit. <laughs> Oh, we can say whatever the fuck Can I know that? Yeah, Yeah, basically it's a roller or a lubricant you rub on your body. It makes you sweat more. It's basically like a latex lubricant and so – or whatever. Uh, And, like, sweating is probably healthy for you, yeah, but, like, are you going to lose weight, like, for 10 minutes? Oh, here we go. Here we go. I got one. Sorry. No, No, hit it. No, the fucking tummy wraps. So that's what the sweet – that's this. this, Oh, that's what that is. It's It's the same same company. No, no, no. Same idea. Same idea. It's not the same thing, but it is the same company. Yeah, one company or multiple companies will do both of those. You lube up and then you wrap up. Got it. And again, like water weight or like making a weight class for something, sure, but like – yeah, or you go to Target or you go to Walmart, you go to the back and you buy the top and bottom sweatsuit. Right. That's how you right. dude I used to rock that shit at fucking oh, Cal God. Fit. Yeah. On a bike for no fucking reason. But it does kind of feel good. Savage. Uh, yeah, I was telling Kyle in my early Savage. commercial days, this dude is like shreddy is like a Jim Carrey. 10% body fat Jim Carrey bod and uh, out of his mind. And I'm, um, you know, the lead trainer there and he, he just like throw things by me. And he's actually out of his mind. You know, he's kind of tweaking on me and he's like water cutting. I'm like, for what? You know, water weight visceral. He like pulls like a skin and like veins are already popping out everywhere. He's like, you know, he's 150 pounds at six. That one. was me wearing the. Yeah. Zero. I'm like, like what yeah. I was like, yeah, yeah man, yeah. you're going to, you're going to die or yeah. that water is going to come back in two days. So I don't know what you're trying to accomplish. Yeah. Here, I think I saw someone it. do it or I read some article in, in bodybuilders magazine, and people do it like, for sure. And I was like a high school kid, you know, or even like right out of college, probably 20 years old at the gym wearing this fucking thing like, yeah. what am i doing yeah, yeah. There's, I, there's a lot of ways we can go about this. well there's because like, yeah. there's supplements left and right like every supplement ever, well i think every test booster, honestly, booster i think the every... supplement i do we has a totally different another day a totally different topic is the, the gimmick supplement it's so bad yeah. it's like it's like more like uh, material uh, yeah i got so many stories on it it's got to be like 97 percent of the shit in there besides like the creatine is useless well, or the yeah. caffeine yeah. but going back to yeah the, yeah or yeah caffeine sure n- creatine uh, uh, maybe glucosamine yeah yeah the the thing with like equipment equipment too is everyone like tries to reinvent the wheel even to this day when when knowledge is everywhere but like why do you think the barbell is a staple in every sport and every gym because that's a gimmick someone made up a hundred years ago that still works yeah. or right? dumbbell, like the barbell yeah. the dumbbell a the kettlebell. kettlebell and even that like you can you kind of exchange a kettlebell and a dumbbell can you do slightly different stuff sure but it's not that you know what i mean like yeah, yeah, yeah. It's it, more convenient version so why are we trying to do all this stuff a cable. Oh. oh, you get slightly different stimulus from a cable. Okay. Money. That's about all we got. Yeah. 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 Actually, flip the whole thing around. is like, how many things do you need? And there's just, we're talking about a whole category of things that people just don't need. No, all of it. Do I need something to hold a weight for me to do curls? Right. No. no. Well, and, and then, like, what's the idea? Like, do you I actually... Hold the, I can hold the dumbbell. It sounds <laughs> stupid, but if you look like a cellular level, like, we can only replicate or grow or shrink a certain amount. You can't... You can't really speed that up without a lot of needles. And so, like, what do you think externally, a barbell versus a dumbbell versus something that holds a barbell or a dumbbell, that's going to 
accelerate the cellular process that's going on in my body? No. Yeah. Like that's insane when you say it like that. But no one thinks that. Like, oh no, man, I heard dumbbells are way better because of the stabilization. So I'm only doing my chest press with with my dumbbells instead of barbells. And then all of a sudden you're gonna get bigger pecs. Like that, it doesn't work that way. The yeah, human yeah. body don't work that way. It so doesn't know that yeah. you're using yeah. a different equipment. It just knows like what move, what muscles are moving and yeah. under what stress. Yeah, yeah. Did you put some blood in that area yeah. or not? <laughs> like it's not gonna speed up the process. Yeah. yeah you can't yeah. speed you're up. You're not the, getting jacked. Yeah. yeah you you're can't speed up your jacked. hair process. Like maybe in a certain amount of protein, but eating extra protein ain't gonna grow your hair. Okay. What about the uh, what about the um, derma roller the neck the neck cage for like I think there's I neck. think there's something there I don't think there's something there for the regular gym bro but there's probably something there for the wrestler jiu jitsu it will g- build muscle because yeah, I mean it is right. resistance right, right? in yeah, your traps yeah, and, and there's muscles and everything we that's do. like yeah, the yeah. fringe of gimmick that's like um, the gimmick fringe yeah less people need it than they think they need it because you yeah, uh, that's I more of a at the old thing, school yeah. uh, even the regular commercial gym there'd be like some old school cat with like uh, a cut off hoodie. We didn't talk about that in our, our fashion. Hey, I love those. Look, yeah, those Fire. are great. Fire. And he's just doing neck all day. Yeah. I'm like, you're just doing they, neck they all do day? They do kind of give it a bad it's rap. neck day? Yeah, yeah for <laughs> so, sure. So, yeah. wrestler. And we should also draw the distinction between the things that you do just for variety and then there's all this other bullshit stuff that people do because they think that they're going to get some mm-hmm. kind of leverage, some kind of yeah. advantage that you can't get from anything else, which is obviously yeah. bullshit. The, the one thing I wanted – I know we're done. But no, you go. Was, uh, which is crazy to me because, like, as kids, for all of us – Icing after you're done, yeah, doing some physical yeah. activity, even icing for injuries is crazy. Yeah, I think that's I, I didn't realize I was blown up in my face. Yeah, no, everyone, everything I read, I was just like, yo, well, it depends, right? If it's muscular or tendon, right? Yeah, but even, even that, like the inflammation your body has, it's like a detox to me. So, your body has livers and kidneys to detox your body internally. We also have systems to build, uh, to fight inflammation. Inflammation is part of uh, part of the process to rebuild. So, why are you trying to accelerate something that you did on purpose? Yeah. Your body will handle it. Yeah, it's kind of great. The cool gimmick, though, which every go listen to fifty percent facts with Andy Galpin if you guys yeah. want the science behind it. Yeah. I'm gonna have to go check that. You one would out. think it's complete bullshit. Is the um, muscle constriction bands or whatever? No, those in are in your legit. head. In your no, head, when are... you see it on paper, you're like, oh, that's such bullshit. That's the best gimmick that's come out. That's legit as shit. Yeah, that's yep. crazy. Yeah, but you have to, to you use them, right? About, right. The yeah, bands? you talked. Uh, yeah, which, BFR, which BFR training. Shout out to Jeremy Linicky at Oklahoma did all the research on that, and it's as legit as you get. Dude, it's sick. The Which bands are we talking the about? The blood flow restriction? Cut. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. All right. Uh, I think we can all agree that nobody needs an upper body support. Oh.